Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel, Mississippi Girl Life. I am Tamika, just a country Mississippi girl living in North Carolina. I am 34 years old and I am the wife to a Marine Corps veteran. I am the mother to three wonderful children, ages 15, 12, and 11. And we have a fur baby, which is Summer, a beagle and pit bull mix. My channel is a variety channel aimed to inspire and motivate you to be better prepared. We do gardening, prepping, to try to save money, and all of that. So if you enjoy the content, go ahead and give me a like, comment, and subscribe. Also, don't forget to look in the description box because there's different links that you may be interested to in. So, I will see y'all in the video if it's Jehovah's Will. Walmart and I want to get a look at what the shelves and everything looks like um, see what's going on in there hello see what's going on um, with the shelves here see what the groceries look like so yeah so let's go ahead and get into this video y'all so as I'm coming in y'all I can already tell as y'all see I'm trying to go slow because a lot of you say I'll be moving too fast when I'm um, showing the shelves. But oh my goodness, look y'all. So this is what the produce. And I already know somebody probably is going to be like, oh, well, it's that time um, when things are not in season. No, we still have stuff. You know, this is lettuce and stuff like this. This is resort of what's going on, okay? This, that's what this is. The results of what's going on. So let's go ahead and look at more. This more produce and stuff like this. Um, but, yeah. So I'm over here where the seafood and stuff is. So as you can see, it's kind of low. So let's go ahead and go over here. This is what I really want to see, the meat. And I know most of y'all want to see the meat too. Um, so yeah. Oh my goodness, y'all. Oh my goodness. Y'all, stock and prepare. Okay? This is my Walmart. Okay? start preparing look this ain't to make nobody panic but if you want to say panic i would say panic and put, start getting your seeds and stuff start growing your own food start raising your own stuff because y'all look at this that's what they have this is the beef area over here where the sausage and the pork and stuff is this is what we have this is what we have what we have you get to see you know and like I say like I've been telling y'all people are settling for whatever they can get you know and y'all know what's gonna happen people are gonna realize there's things that may not agree with them because they can't buy the stuff that they normally would buy and so that caused more issues y'all <sighs> I can't stress it enough, um, the importance of getting your seeds and stuff and start starting your garden. If it's small, big, whatever, start growing some food and stuff for you and your family. If you want to get you some, you know, chickens and stuff like that, do it. Here's where the sandwich meats and stuff are. Well, no, this is the sandwich meats on now. This is the bacon. So as y'all can see, look at this, y'all. Look at this, y'all. This is my Walmart. When in the world have you saw shelves like this? You know, like at Walmart. Like, come on. Everybody's saying, oh, uh, it's, it's gonna get better and all this. Where? Where? Please tell me, please show me. This is 2022, okay? And this is what they warned about all right this is what they warned about i mean come on people come on 
Look at this. And my thing is, I'm worried about the elderly and the, the disabled and the people that's sick and stuff that can't get out and do what they need to do. You need to make sure that you are stocking up. And, and it's nothing wrong with helping other people that's not able to help themselves like that. You know, if you're able-bodied and you're able to do, do what you can. And don't just think about yourself, you know. Think about the people that you may you may um be able to help that cannot do what they what you and i can do you know if you're able-bodied so yeah the cheese area the hair gaps and stuff in there it seems like it's it's okay but what's the you i mean cheese is nut is something but like they are even low but it's better than none but when this is gone i'll give this probably until next week and this probably will be gone in my area you know so yes y'all this is sad oh my goodness y'all oh my freaking goodness y'all look at this look at this this is the butter area you can see it's low it's low for the amount of people that we have here People are going to starve, y'all. People are going to be crazy because they can't get food. You see this? And people is just going on by. A lot of people, but a lot of people is waking up. But some is just going on by like they don't see what's going on. But they'll be the main one trying to take your food. And it's not right. So yes, y'all, prepare while you can. Prepare while you can. Okay, prepare while you can. These eggs, hopefully, if it's God's will, I won't have to worry about no eggs in the next couple of months because my chickens should do. That's why I'm doing what I'm doing now. Putting in work now to make sure that I have a head start and don't have to buy the baby chicks in the spring. If you got an extra room or something, get you some baby chicks now. Yes, it's cold, but how did head start? So it won't be too much longer um, that they will start producing, okay? This is the milk. This is the milk. This is what they have left for the milk, okay? So, yes. Look at this. Over here is the yogurt. Look at this. Yes, it's just like, you know, it's just really, really, it's really, 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 really sad that, and you know, I have a lot of people come in the comments, to my, it's all about who you voted for, for first of all, mind your mouth, you don't even know me, <laughs> you don't even know me, I'm not a political person, and I don't even vote, <laughs> and probably would be surprised if I did. But they come and they bump their gums and just be rude and mean. And it's not even about that. It's about what's going on now and how we can do as a whole to help each other out. That's what it's about. But they don't care about that, okay? Now I'm gonna move fast because I can hear music. Yes, but they don't care about that. Look at this, y'all. Look at this. Look at this. This is Walmart. Look, they have like made it go further out so it, you know, they could take up some space. But y'all see that? That's all that's there for that cheese. Y'all see this? Okay. Look at this. They expanded it out to try to take up some space, but you know, it's just not, you know. Yeah. This is like the juice aisles and stuff like that. And as you can see, they low, very low. That's what it looks like. Look at this. My local Walmart. You know, this is what we have to work with. This is what we have to work with. 
This is what we have to work with. Even the paper area, y'all. Like your paper plates, stuff like this. This is not the norm, okay? And y'all know this, y'all know this. So many YouTubers are bringing awareness to what's going on. And a lot of people I will say is taking notes and taking this seriously. But you still got those that don't. And it's just, you can't help everybody. Now I wanna bring some to y'all attention. They got a lot of junk food. Not a lot actually, <laughs> take that back. No, because I'm looking things up full. So they got more junk food, but they still low on the junk food, okay? Look at this. The cereal, though, is really taking a hit, okay? But at the same time, this is what people are settling for. Do you see? A lot of the healthy cereal is gone. So you come here looking for that special K or whatever you have that's healthier, this is what you got to get. That's why we were saying stock up. But have a way to keep that stuff as much as possible stocked up. That's for your gardening. I can't stress gardening. And, and if you have a way to, to get an animal or two to have, you know, you know what you need. Y'all get what I'm saying. Okay, y'all. Look at this. The noodles. Y'all see this? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, okay. More empty shells, bare shells. Let me just go right around here. So you can see back there, they pulling everything like they supposed to, to the front. It's serious, y'all. Trying to hear it through, y'all, so I don't have to add too much music. I, I hear music playing in here. I hope y'all can't hear it that good, though. We talked about being stocked up on canned food, canned meats and stuff like that. Well, that's what we have to work with now. That one last, everybody come here for this, that one last holly, nothing, okay? Let's go down here. All y'all get tomato paste and stuff like that. Oh my goodness. Like, come on. Here's the frozen food. Yeah, I end up getting five more of these, so I have them. These are the feeders, y'all, because I need them, especially on these cold days. I can't get out there, uh, these waterers. So that's what I picked up. So while I'm in here, I wanted to show y'all. See? What it's looking like. I don't know if y'all can really see, but they are empty. You know but I don't want this video too long y'all so y'all get the point okay even the bread even the bread all right okay y'all so I'm ending this video um, y'all stock up okay do what you gotta do do what you gotta do don't it, it's time to, to stop having a good old time and party and not doing anything for yourself your livelihood okay things is real things is bad so please stock up and do what you got to do okay please
just a piece in the game To the miserable ends of You're not kidding me no matter how hard you try So just stay off Come near and I'll leave, I'm just fine getting by Fall about me Wave my own way See the truth behind it Am I the Okay, y'all, so that's the end of the video. I hope you were motivated. I hope you enjoyed the content. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, y'all. Hit the notification bell so you can be notified each and every time that I upload a video. And also, check out the information in the description box below because it has a lot of links to different things that you may be interested in. So with that being said, y'all be safe, and I'll see you in the next one if it's Jehovah's will. Bye.